Hello traders, today's top stories. Wall Street will begin its trading with the Dow Jones still near record highs, and investors are braced for Robert Kaplan of the Federal Reserve to speak later. It's Tuesday, May the 9th, and here is our New York Review. The three major indexes in the U.S. on Monday were limited to fractional gains. Data will remain relatively light in the state, but the JOLT's job opening survey is scheduled to be released. And importantly, later in the day, a speech by FOMC member Robert Kaplan in Dallas will get the attention of Federal Reserve watchers. The U.S. central bank is expected to raise interest rates in June, and Kaplan's speech may provide more hawkish rhetoric. The Dow Jones Industrial Index remains above the 21,000 mark and it is expected to open with slight gains according to the future markets trading among equities. Japanese equities finished today's trading with slight declines, but this followed a very strong day of gains for the Nikkei and Topics indexes on Monday. Both Japanese exchanges remain near important high water marks. However, average cash earnings from Japan came in with a negative minus 0.4% result earlier on Tuesday. Risk appetite has certainly been prevalent among Japanese investors the past couple of weeks, so tomorrow's trading will be watched closely. The yen has remained weaker against the US dollar and is another indication that risk sentiment remains strong in Japan. Economic data from the European Union has been better the past month, but this morning's reports from Germany and Italy produced disappointing results. German trade balance statistics were negative and Italian retail sales proved uninspired. And while an outcome was better than expectation for the German industrial production figures, no parades will ignite because of the rather lackluster numbers. However, European indexes, including the DAX and FTSE, have put in early gains this morning. The euro has been under slight pressure against the US dollar, while the pound has held firm. British traders should also be aware that the Bank of England will release its monetary policy summary and inflation report on Thursday. Crude oil remains in a tight consolidated range after having been taking lower early last week. A price range of 46 to 47 US dollars a barrel has continued to dominate recent trading. Tomorrow, crude oil inventories will be released in the States and could impact the marketplace if it produces a large surprise. Investors will pay attention to Dallas Fed President Robert Kaplan's speech at an economic summit which will take place in the U.S. at 8.15 p.m. GMT. Thank you all for watching, have a wonderful trading day and we will see you again soon.